Hello everyone, welcome back to U4, One Faith. I'm Paradox Gamer, thank you for joining me. Uh, I just realized that I don't have to wait with Delhi because I'm gonna feed Multan. Um, so, I've prepared the peace deal here. I'm giving this stuff here to Multan, and I'm taking the money and some more vibrations. That will give some more extension to. Uh, does that say here how much would they get but I think this should be okay send demand and that takes my integration from 31 down to 24 but that's okay we'll get there eventually I don't think I will feed them much more than this though let me check the culture um, actually we could still feed them a little bit I'm gonna take the off culture provinces myself next time or they could start converting themselves which is uh, highly unlikely since they haven't done so already it looks like Bengal and Delhi has been reduced to one more uh, conquests I haven't done the math but it looks like it from from the overview so we're waiting for this one to fall, it's at plus 28, and then we'll attack Ethiopia. Also, I'll get a little bit closer before I attack Morocco. Um, I probably need a navy up here. I got a navy here, though. Let's get it to rendezvous over there. Actually, let's just attack Morocco now. It's just a two stack here, it can't really do much. Alright. Um, right, so now it's only Ethiopia that we're waiting for. Continue marching down this way. We've got a 45 stack here and it's crossing. How can it cross there? Oh, because he owns both sides, uh, that's the new rules. He's getting back across the strait. I think he wants to take my lands in Palembang area. I do have 33 transports, so I can al could always just transport my guys back and forth. It's not a, it's not a big problem. Alright, so while that is happening... Let's check out something else. Start converting all of that stuff. Alright, so these guys will arrive up there. We've occupied the next little bit. And we'll go down here. And then we cannot go any further until Patani falls. Yeah, he's heading down to take down the to take out these uh, provinces down here. That's fine. Let him do that. We got cores. That takes our extension down to what? 61. Is there anything we can end? Um, I don't think so right now. No, not right now. Morocco occupied draw, but I will catch them here. Boop. Can I go through these places? No. So just leave one guy there and head to the coastline. And, oh, actually we need one guy. And let's just use the same... No, let's use another guy. To go in there. And the others will head for the coast. The navy is coming. So he's got a 13 stack there. So now I need one of the generals. So we got two up here. Yeah, I'm gonna need this guy. Uh, no leader. By the way, sent this guy up there as well. And then come back to Indonesia. Put the general on there. He's got siege. Siege one. It's better than nothing. And move into Patani. Okay. 
we got Palembang occupied by Pasai. Now we occupy Drawback. We actually have a naval battle going on here. Let's see, so he's got two heavies, I got none. But I do have 19 galleys. Supported by 36 transports. Let's see if I can take his heavies out with my galleys. Uh, I couldn't take out the heavies. But I just won the battle. We occupied Kasati, that's right there. So bring these guys out as well. And we occupied Kedah. So now these guys are stuck. I could just bring up the navy. Because it's not really useful there anyway. I can't I'm not blocking, I'm just blocking his navy from, from getting out of port. Hmm. Let's see how many transports. 33. I could uh, take some of the transports, say 5. Move them up here and then start moving these guys around on the ships. Can I not just click it? Really? I really have to take them manually? Looks like it, yeah. Conversion done. Keep going. Alright, let's go back to Morocco, see what's going on. We're currently repairing ships. But they're okay. Let's just um, take Ifni first. Yeah, just get everybody, that's fine. Go here. Siege of the Lull is over. That means we can... Oh, sorry. Take that. And all their money. I could also just convert them. No, that's not an option. Okay. Call that up straight away. And send these five guys over here. Now, do we want to reduce some more extension? Yeah, why not? Not over extension. Local autonomy, raise that. Why are these guys black flagged? I don't know what's going on here. Alright, bring them back in, this is annoying. For some reason that didn't work. Right, who cares? Go back here. Actually, send them around to the other side so we can get some some. Uh, what's that? Some blockading going on. Uh, meanwhile, gotta watch Multan and Rebels. How about about the Riasan Rebels? Yeah, they got it under control. Riasan's units are still just standing right there. 
Alright, Kassan. Muscovy has a car on you. I wonder if Riasan would go in and attack them. I got no Castle Spilly on those guys. Hmm. Well, that's, that's a bit annoying. Uh... Ah, we can wait with that, that's uh, not really important. Get these guys on here. Ship lost at James Bay. Oh, that's because... Uh, I don't have any... <laughs> Supplies up there. Grand aids. All lose 50 admin. I'm gonna grant the aid. Uh, it's a good thing I uh, remembered to actually land these guys. But the five ships are gone. Who wants to get through? New Hollandia. I don't think so. Another conversion is done. Get that going. Ottomans occupy Ifni. Gotta get that naval battle done first. Conversion. See if I can get his heavies. Nope. Well, they're pretty beat up, so I need them to come back in. Siege of Simeon is over. Alright, so we can piece out that. Let's see what my extension is 72, so I got 28 points. This will cost 12.8, so no problem. And all the money. Alright, get that card up. Uh, wrong one, this one. And then we're ready to attack um, Ethiopia. Maybe I should just wait a second and get these guys around so I can get one big blow on him. Let's do that. It's always a good way to start a war, to obliterate the enemy army. He usually speeds things up quite a bit. these guys doing? Protecting trade in Gulf of Aden. Really? Let's go back to Morocco. And the ships here are okay, I think. One is at 80%. Get the guys on. Send them up here. Gotta settle the score. Conversion done, keep going with this one. It's gonna be another naval battle here. Nope, they, uh, they pulled back in. Okay, let's land on top of them. I don't have a general, and they are probably, yeah, fully capable. We gained a lot of course. So this could be a nasty battle. If so, I could just pull back out to sea. Which 
Truth expired with key, that doesn't matter. We will land uh, tomorrow. Alright, give me a good battle here. I need some decent rolls. I get decent rolls. Alright, I think we got that under control. Yes, and it's only a level 1 fort. Not sure where they're going. In any case, I cannot follow them there. So, Ethiopia. Merge up these guys. Attack them. And just move straight in there. Get these guys up here. Conversion done. It looks like a stack wipe almost. He's got another smaller stack down there. Get this one going. That is a stack wipe. Nice. Uh, so the capital is a level one. Let's split up in two, I think. And then send the good one, the one with the siege leader, up to this level six fort. The other one will stay in the capital. Don't worry, Ethiopia will produce a lot more troops. Alright. What about down here? Plus 21 for the siege. We could bring in some more guns if we need to. Let's keep focused on Ethiopia. This is where things are happening. I don't know where these guys are going though. Headed for the nearest fort, which is over here. Okay. Whatever. Actually, the nearest fort is here. We got Gondor already, that's the capital. Let me see, then we have a level 2 fort, level 4 fort. Let's get that level 2 fort quickly. And these guys will keep working their way around. I think they will return to defend the, the uh, capital or take back the capital. That's fine, there'll spend some, uh, some precious time on that. We're back to 30% uh, integrating Multan. Siege of Patani is finally over. We go straight to the next castle, which is right there, and these guys can go down there. Nice and slowly. Another conversion. Let's see, our king is now six. So we're looking at a nine-year regency if the, uh, if the king dies. And I got lots of war started up so either way it's not gonna be too bad from now on out come over there yeah it looks like he's rebuilding his army in the capital Perak has been occupied. And so he's here with a 36 stack. Just standing there. I'm also just standing here, waiting for that fort to fall. After that fort falls, then we can get some actual action going. In Morocco, we are at 56. That should fall very soon. That will end the war with Morocco. Lots of work in Ethiopia still. Here. 
conversion. I think we'll put a break in here. Things are looking pretty good still. We'll take a big chunk out of Ethiopia. We'll take a big chunk out of Passai. And then after that we can start a war with Naja Pahid. If we still have a king who is alive. And then we need to start on the Europeans. We got Brittany we can work on. I also need to fight France once. Because he's got two provinces here that are not getting converted. Um, that's going to be in the next episode. Thank you for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.